Hey, how's it going, guys? Jose Baez Jr. here. You are now watching World's Strongest Fan. Hey guys and welcome back to another video. First up it's Dean Madden with an Atlas Stone, weighing 180 kilos or 396 pounds. No problems today for Dean. Following on from him though, it's Joshua Eisel with the new under 105 kilo world record. That's over 227 kilos. We now move into the bench press and first up it's Julia Mills. This is her new personal best. It's 141 kilos or 310 pounds. Next up it's Christy Hawkins. She says, I picked up a personal record for a triple. I actually missed this during my meat prep. It's 145 kilos or 320 pounds for three reps. Next up it's Bob Matthews. He's also looking strong today, pressing 217.5 kilos or 480 pounds for two reps. Next up it's Dan Bell, who says, 515 pounds close grip. Still trying to peak? Ask my wife. That's 233 kilos or 515 pounds for three reps. We now move into some overhead pressing and here is Kane Francis. It's his new personal best, 174 kilos or 383 pounds and he also misses the re-rack. Next up we join Matthew McKeegan. He's working on that big wooden log. He says, it's nice to get a session in somewhere other than my own gym for a change. The weight, 136 kilos or 300 pounds for two reps. Now next up and using a split jerk technique, it's Tyler Young, who says, I'm real happy with this to close out my heavy log work for Denver. The weight, 154 kilos or 340 pounds. Next up, we join Spencer Remick and he's an awesome log presser. He says, static lifts continue to improve and that's all I can ask for. This is also important because static lifts are all people tend to care about and that's 170 kilos or 375 pounds for three reps. We now join Vladislav Gershinov who says, this is my first SBD day in a long time, squatting 265 kilos for two reps. Following on from him, it's another powerlifter. This is Tony Cliff. He says, I'm doing some raw squats today for three reps. The weight on the bar, 275 kilos or 606 pounds and making all of those look really comfortable. Next up we join someone else squatting. It's Maxime Boudreau out in Canada. He's getting ready for the Shaw Classic. The weight 317.5 kilos or 700 pounds for two reps. Now he's back again. Here is powerlifter Bob Matthews squatting with a weight of 329.5 kilos or 727 pounds for two reps. We now move out to Germany and here is Dennis Kolrus. He says, this is my last training session before the German championships. Tire flip will be one of eight tough disciplines. He's hoping to finish strong and let's see if he can get that title again. He's a really great competitor and definitely one of the strongest in Germany. We've now got a couple of moving events and here is Spencer Remick. He's got some really strong grip. He says, I love training farmer's walk. That's pretty much it. And that's 184 kilos or 405 pounds in each hand. Following on from him, it's powerlifter turned strongman Luke Nall, who says, just some light movement today to stay moving. Feeling better each day. It's 249 kilos or 550 pounds. And someone else training yoke was Jose Baez Jr. who says, Finally, 1,010 pounds for 40 feet. This is my first time breaking 1,000 pounds on a yoke and it's my new personal record. And he rounds out the first half of today's video. Now we kick off the second part of today's video with the deadlift section. Here is Iceland's strongest woman 2022 Ragnar Der Jonas Dortir with a new personal record. It's 220 kilos or 485 pounds. Next up it's Julia Mills who says it's safe to say I have a love-hate relationship with deadlifts especially the raw variety but that's 220 kilos or 485 pounds from her also. 
Here's a clip from powerlifter Yangsu Ren. He's actually pulling conventional for a change. He says, This is my midweek SPD day with triples. The weight, 322 kilos or 710 pounds. Next up, we join Ashton Ruska. He says, Today was a really solid day. My deadlift hasn't felt this good in so long. 337.5 kilos or 744 pounds for two reps. Next up, we join strongman Sean May, who says, A quick suited deadlift session with my top single, 340 kilos or 750 pounds. Now, someone else also pulling that with no straps is Sahida Regby, a really great powerlifter. Following on from him and pulling on a silver dollar deadlift setup, it's Tom Head, who says, I finally got to try out a silver dollar deadlift, probably my favourite looking deadlift of all. It was so much fun. Next up and also doing deadlift is powerlifter Ray Bowring, the son of champion powerlifter Dean Bowring. It's a new personal best for him today, with 350 kilos or 771 pounds. Next up, we join strongman Tim Buck, who says, Today I worked up to hitting comp weight of £800 for the Shaw Classic, pulling from a height of 13 inches. Next up, it's Bob Matthews. He says, This is a fun fact. This matches my VA Pro performance. 365 kilos or £804 for two reps. Now next up, it's the most impressive lift of this video. It comes from under 90 kilo strongman Dan Benson. Here is the new under 90 kilo world record. The weight, 382.6 kilos or 843.4 pounds. And didn't that look easy? Next up, it's Dylan Hellregal, who says, It's been a very long time coming. I haven't pulled over 400 kilos since the Pro Raw 11 back in March 2019. Now next up I've got some competition news and here are the events for this year's Arnold Strongman Classic UK. You can see they've got a deadlift for reps. They've also got a dumbbell overhead weighing 100 kilos. Next up they're doing a beast joke weighing 500 kilos. Following on from that it's a bag over bar of a height of 4 meters followed by the Arnold Stone Carry and finishing off with an Atlas Stone Run. It should be a really great competition. And the final bit of news today comes from Denmark's Strongest Man 2022, the winner, Anders Aslak Pedersen. Congratulations to him. Second place was Oliver Storgard, also known as the Great Dane. And in third place, it was newcomer Magnus Berg. Congratulations to all three guys. Now seeing us out today, it's powerlifter Jesus Olivares. The weight on his bar, 347 kilos or 765 pounds for four reps. Notice his technique, going really low and exploding out of the hole. He's an awesome powerlifter and showing us what he can do today. Anyway guys, that's it from me. I really hope you enjoyed this video. If you did, give it a thumbs up and hit subscribe. And I'll catch you again as always on the next one.